<laughs> what if Clay comes in? Will you relax? Come on. I, I called Lennox and told me Clay what was working What if Nadine, his secretary, comes in and she finds that the keys to the office are missing? It's Friday, it's July, and it's 6 o'clock. It's happy hour. Nadine's not going to be anywhere in sight. Will you just relax? Oh, okay. okay. I'll relax. Breaking and entering just calms me right All now. Right. See, 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 see. We've already been through this once, you and I, okay? Yeah, and we've been in jail once also. Well, we had the charges dropped, didn't we? Thanks to my lawyer. And if we need him, we'll use him again. Let's get to work, all right? Tess said the file was going to be in here. Good old cradle file. Let's see, one of these keys might work. Oh. Pin or anything. Keep your head up. This is ridiculous. That's no, not ridiculous. <laughs> okay. okay. Stay still. There. You look terrific. <laughs> the jacket's too big. It's the baggy look. It's a very gray, very dull look. It's the very French look. Steffi, believe me, I know a beautiful woman when I see one. I'm not a beautiful woman. Well, I happen to disagree. Steffi, what is it? Oh, I'm sorry. I... Now is not the time for daydreaming, sweetheart. It's just, I haven't been here in a long time, and I can't help thinking about certain things that happen. You want to think about something? Think about Clay and your mother in front of the Justice of the Peace. See the beautiful white veil she's wearing, the lace dress. Don't do this. See the flowers she's holding. Smell them. Hear her say, I do, till death do us part. Watch Clay kiss the bride. Stop it. Oh, really? You're not, you're not, you're not upset by this. Um, Clay comes home and he says, oh, hi, Steffi. You're a really sweet kid and I like you and all, but, well, your mom and I got a little something going Stop on the it. side. Are you angry? Yes. Are you angry? Yes. Good. Then take it out on that. That's some very healthy anger. That's good. That's good. That's good. Look at this. Cradle Foundation. Here we go. Here we go. Wait a minute. It's just bills. Bills for what? Invalid care. I told you to stay away from me. Will you listen to me? What? Tess came. She came to the house for a visit. So? So? She deliberately kept dropping the word cradle. She knows something. I can sense it. So Cooper's filled her in. Big deal. Well, you seem awfully calm about all well, of this. What else should I be, Deborah? The game is over. Will How you stop saying that? You? Just stop it. All right. All right. We know, we know that he's escaped. But besides you and me, there is no one here that knows that he's alive. He's wandering around God knows where. How long do you think it's going to be before somebody recognizes him, huh? And if I know him, he is already back in Corinth. Well, what are we supposed to do? Roll over and play dead? A perfectly appropriate thing to do, I would say. Well, there's one other problem, and that's Cooper. I have to keep him out of this, and I'm not going to do it. You have to do it. Oh, really? And what about Steffi? Have you noticed that she and I aren't exactly close lately? Hmm? Well, I'll handle her. I've done it before, and I can do it now. What? What in the world was that? What are you talking about? I didn't hear anything. Well, I did. And after that incident at the bank, I wouldn't put anything past Cooper and Stephanie. Being paranoid, Deborah. May I come in? Oh, Tess, it was you. What was? You know, it really is customary to knock before you enter a room. Uh, my apologies. And some people even call first. Deborah, I appreciate the helpful hints, but I'm actually here to see Clay. Well, Clay and I are busy, aren't we, Clay?
Well, far be it from me to interrupt business. I'll call for an appointment. Fine. Ah! Is it? Is Nothing. It hilarious I must to have you, Tess? twisted my ankle. Oh, I, uh, my heel. My heel is loose. Your heel? Well, I hope it's good enough to carry you out of here. I really need to speak with Clay. Uh, Tess, haven't you bothered us enough for one day? Go bother, go bother Cooper. If he's not too busy with Stephanie, that is. Cooper's charming. He's very charming, but he doesn't know anything about the Cradle Foundation, which Clay does. So, you have been talking to him, haven't you? How could I be talking to Cooper when he's so busy with Steffi? You know, Tess, it's a funny thing about cradles. They rock when the wind blows. And when the bow breaks, they come tumbling down, dumping anybody who's in them. Stay out of this cradle business, Tess, and tell your boyfriend to do the same. Now, why don't we escort you downstairs? Shave. I spoke to Lennox. He said he said that, that Clay would be working at home all day. Cooper. Well, that's what Lennox told me. All right. At least I didn't open my mouth well, under I'm the sorry, desk. But when I heard Lennox say that she could handle me, I know. All she right. Before all she right. will right. now, right. I, I wanted to kill her. All right. Killing's a little extreme. We'll just take her out of circulation eventually. I thought you said all this was going to be over before dinner, huh? Well, we're doing pretty well. We found out a bunch of stuff, and we'll be able to nail your mother soon enough. I'm too tired to nail anybody right now. Oh, you can't give up now, Nancy Drew, now that we're so close. Can we please just call it a night, Sherlock? Sure. Don't call me Sherlock. Don't call me Nancy. I could sleep for a week. Let's go. Oh. Hello. When did you get here, Steffi? About a half hour ago. What? <laughs> she was under the desk, too. Sounds like fun. We're not here to have fun. Oh, we came to get a crack at the cradle files. So I gathered. Yeah, and we uh, saw them. Really? How? Well, you know, brains and brawn. I was the uh, brains, and she kicked the door open. <laughs> it's pretty funny. <laughs> I might have found a more subtle way. I told you I would help you. Well, you know, I am interested in this too, Tess. I mean, my mother is slightly involved. Not to mention your lover. Believe me, Clay is not my lover anymore. Really? Has the part been recast? Hey, no, I, Steffi and I, there's nothing going on <laughs> Less between. Less than nothing. Le <laughs> Believe me. Yeah. <laughs> Did I say anything? No, it just you were insinuating that under the desk Cooper. that we were... Cooper, please, don't lose your sense of humor. <laughs> I'm trying not to. It's um. So how did you get away from Clay and Deborah? Oh, they saw me out, and uh, they took off, and I came back. Oh, well, it's a good thing you came back when you... when It's a good thing you came in earlier when you did, because they were about yeah, to... Yeah, yeah, they, they would have found us for sure. I Thanks. think so. Yeah. Anything for the cause. Yeah. And I'm sorry if I scared you by tickling your ankle. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, it did startle me. I'm sorry. Oh, that's okay. You know how I feel about ankle contact. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's just too bad there were so many people in the room. Yeah, we heard some interesting things um, before you came in. Was... Well, I heard some interesting things after. You know what, guys? Clay's not kidding around. Maybe we should just drop this whole thing. No way. Hey, listen, you didn't want to get involved in this in the first place, and, uh, you know, maybe you should pull out. Uh, no, I wouldn't blame you if you no, did. No, 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 no. Stand by your man, remember? <laughs> um, excuse me, guys. I'm, I'm going to take off now. Oh, yeah, well, but I, I, I drove you over here. I mean, how are you going to get back? I'll, I'll, I'll take you. No, that's okay. Thanks. I hope I didn't say anything to upset her. Oh, no, 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 no. She's, she's tired, complaining all day. Grumpy. Yeah, this is taking a lot out of her, huh? It has. It really has. <laughs> Why don't you give her a break? And I'll fill in as best I can. <laughs> Thanks, Tess. Is that lock still open? Ah. Uh -huh. Come on, let's make sure we lock it. 